Hello folks, this is Jamil Sir for Gunstruck Reviews. We're here at C2 Tactical in Scottsdale, Arizona, our favorite indoor facility. And we're gonna, today we're gonna start a series of videos that is gonna be an evolution, not an evolution, I would say, I would call it more like a customizing uh, project. We're gonna show how much you can take the SIG P320 by using all the plethora of amazing custom knickknacks for it. There's a ton of things you can do to it. This is a basic SIG P320, okay? Has nothing done to it. This is a comes from the factory. This is the standard full-size P320. This is the P320 X Super, which you can see here, it has the X grip, the a flat uh, trigger, and which is shorter, has the carry grip, which is shorter and uh, has a shorter rail on it and it's cut for red dot. Okay, first of all, before we start the whole series, if the only thing you know about the P320 is negative, and that's the only comment you wanna make, please don't. This is not about any of the many things that have been said on the interwebs about the SIG P320. What I wanna talk about is the possibilities with the P320 with all the different companies out there which are close to 100 different companies now making parts for it from grips to sights to um, red dots to um, you know trigger components, you name it, uh, plates to mount uh, red dots on it. I mean, you name it. There's so many companies out there that are making parts for it that you know, this is what we want to talk about. We're going to keep this positive. So the first thing in this is the first introductory video we're not going to do any customization, we're just going to talk about it. And since the, and I want to tell you, I want to be brutally honest about it. Since the first P320 first came out, I got it in 2014, if I'm not mistaken. And it, was, it looked something like this. This, again, has been modified over the years when they had the big recall over the, the trigger, the disconnector that they added. Uh, subsequently, um, I didn't like it. I didn't like the original grip. To me, it didn't fit my hand. Honest, when I got the first 2014 model, I'm like, this thing feels like a two by four. And nothing against it. In 2017, after SHOT Show, I said, I want to give it another try. So I ended up getting two of them, okay? I got one from SIG that I purchased from them and then I got one from our distributor, and I got to a point that there's so many people starting to make parts for it and customizing it. My friend Doug at Mullen Labe at that time, he laser etched my grip for me and put the gun sight uh, bird on it, and he also had this, basically put a mag weld that was, wasn't meant for it, but he made it fit, and it was glued in, basically with epoxy, and it was, solid there. And then Apex came out with a trigger. A Springer Precision had the Mac catch. And these things that started, this is the, the, the genesis of the customizing for the P320. Now, basically, I like the X grip, even though this is the medium grip, it's still big in my hand, okay? But to me, it's a whole lot more comfortable than this one. And this is the factory um, flat trigger. It's about five, six pounds, not bad, but there are better triggers out there that are a safe. Like for example, Apex Tactical Trigger, they're doing some great products and we're gonna be bringing those into you too. So, and we'll be changing things like Mac catches and all sorts of things on this pistol. So I'll ask you to please keep an open mind, listen, and you don't have to go run out and buy one of these. I'm just gonna be showing you what's out there. If you already own one of these, then you can say, wow, I can do that? Or like Oracle used to say, did I do that? So let's go ahead and keep an open mind and let's go ahead and look at this pistol. Now, this is chapter one. Chapter two is coming up with the first small customization we're gonna do. And like this video, share this video and subscribe to the channel. And like always, please remain healthy, stay safe, and definitely have fun on the range. Thank you for watching Gunstock Reviews.
please visit our website at www.gunstockreviews.com for more exclusive content. Please visit our patron page at www.patreon.com slash gunstockreviews. Your contributions would be greatly appreciated and help us grow our selections and frequency of videos.